Gary, a happy manager? Yeah, yeah. I've um, been feeling a little bit under the weather the last couple of days, so that's that's cheered me up a little bit. You know, it's uh, nice to get another four goals. Nice to get the clean sheet. Um, some good performances. Uh, we had to be patient. First half, there wasn't too many, too many chances. You know, we maybe our final ball right around the 18-yard box uh, wasn't quite good enough first half, but. I said to the players, you know, sometimes it's more difficult to play against ten men, you know, and you normally find that. But we, we got the quick goal, which was important, um, and then we picked them off after that um, and scored another three. So delighted, it's a big three points for us. Um, you know, we've got to stick in there. We've got to, we've got to keep picking up points to stay with the, the ones that keep winning in that top five. We've got to, we've got to stay in there, um, and then you know, wait, bide our time and, and hopefully creep in there. Keith said, "Might say the sending off was was a turning point, but as you say, Robbie having scored three minutes later." Yeah, well, I'm, I'm sure it was. You know, it's it's never nice having a, a man sent off, but sometimes, as a team, and I've done it with my own teams, you grow a strength with ten men, and sometimes it's hard to to break them down. I think the important thing is, is like I say, you score a quick goal when when that happens, uh, and we've done that today. We've done that. So once you go one nil up, it sort of knocks them back a little bit and you could see that. Um, we kept the ball well. Um, Dominic was on fire today. He was the Dominic voice that we know. You know, give him the ball and anything can happen. His goal was, you know, incredible. Both of them, even his, his, his second one, the strike is not easy coming across him. Um, but I thought he was unbelievable today. Um, you know, that's the Dominic that's the Dominic we know and um, he's a match winner, there's no doubt There's no doubt about that. But great to get four four goals and great to get three points. Yeah, that's the best goal that's been scored at the race course for some time, I'd imagine his first, wasn't it? Uh, well, I would think so. You know, Certainly this season, since I've been here, you do well to find a, a better goal than that. Um, but it doesn't surprise me with him, you know. It's, it's what he's capable of. Um, it was probably a little bit better than his free kick first half. And... Um, <laughs> You know, it's uh, it's nice to see him do that. You know, he's, he's scoring goals, he's scoring goals, and scoring some good goals. And you, I always feel when he cuts in that he's he's going to hit the target and maybe score a goal, and that's a nice feeling to have. It's all about momentum, isn't it, Gary? There's three wins now on the bounce, another four goals. Yeah. It's going well. Well, we, we we needed to, we needed to because we went through that spell, didn't we? You know, and um, we said we had to respond, and we've taken ten points from the last twelve. Uh, that's 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 a big. Ratio of points out of four games, and um, like I say, the most important thing is because I think you look at it, most teams up there have won again today. So you know it's important that we stay with them. We've got to show that we're capable of staying with them. Um, and, I, and I think you know scoring goal. As like I said all along, I think we'll uh, we'll score goals. Our downside has been conceding. We've got a clean sheet today, so I'm really pleased with that. You had to change things before. Before kickoff as well, with Javin Vidal pulling out. What was this? What's the what's the news there? Yeah, he, he was just feeling his groin in the warm up, so we had to make the change. And to be honest, at half time, Reese, um, you know, was, was advised he should come off the keeper uh, with a clash in the first half. His, his, his leg was up like a balloon, and, and we tried not to, to go back to him too many times uh, than, than we needed to today. Um, so you know, we're going to hope that. That's going to settle down because his, his leg's not in a good in a good way, and obviously, you know, I don't have the, the keeper on the bench, so it was a little bit panic stations at half time of, of taking him off when it was nil nil. Um, but we kept him out there. He said, you know, don't go back to him, don't go back to him too too many times if, if we don't need to. Um, luckily for us, they they didn't really squeeze us from goal kicks and things like that, so he was able to to pass the ball out. But um, yeah, a couple a couple of things today, Javan and. Um, John Nolan come off with a hamstring as well, so just these little things, you know, you don't need. We're talking about picking from a sw small, uh, a fully fit squad before the game, and then you know you pick up two, two or three injuries during the game. So we're just going to monitor it through the week. So after a great win like today, some say, well, the game on Tuesday night would be good, but uh, with the injuries, I'm sure you're glad to have a week off again. Well, yeah, I think I think it's good for us at the moment having a little break, you know, uh, for a lot of reasons, and then I, I said. To the players this week, and I said today that you know I think we're in a good place at the moment mentally. I think the uh, the feeling around the changing room is very very good, um, but that feeling has to go and, and prove me right out there on the field. And I asked them to do that today. Go and prove me right. I've told them that I'm liking the way it's feeling around the football club at the moment. I'm liking how the dressing room's feeling, and go and prove me right. And, and we've done that. Enjoy tonight. Thank you.
Thank you, man. Thank you for that.